accumulators operate on the principle of potential energy. In years gone by, this was achieved through the use of a dead weight. However, spring type accumulators or hydro pneumatic type accumulators are still used in modern hydraulic applications, with hydro pneumatic being the predominant type. Hydro pneumatic accumulators use hydraulic fluid to compress the nitrogen gas, hence the name hydro pneumatic accumulators. Of the four principal hydro pneumatic accumulator types, being bladder, diaphragm, piston, and metal bellows, we will discuss the bladder type accumulator. Nitrogen gas is used to fill the bladder to a specified pressure through the gas valve at the top of the accumulator. This is known as the gas precharge pressure, or P0. The volume of gas within the accumulator is known as the effective gas volume, or V0. Note that in this configuration, the bladder is holding closed the poppet on the fluid port assembly, and there is no hydraulic fluid within the accumulator. Once the system pressure increases above the gas precharge pressure, the poppet valve opens, the hydraulic fluid enters the accumulator, and the bladder is compressed. The hydraulic fluid will continue compressing the bladder if the system hydraulic pressure increases. P1 is the minimum system operating pressure, and V1 is the corresponding nitrogen volume at that pressure. It is important to note that the hydraulic system pressure and the nitrogen gas pressure are always in equilibrium. As the system pressure increases, the bladder and nitrogen gas continue to compress, which results in more hydraulic fluid being present in the accumulator. At this point, the accumulator is storing hydraulic fluid at the maximum system operating pressure, P2. If the hydraulic pressure in the system drops, the bladder will expand, forcing hydraulic fluid from the accumulator back into the system.